Hello guys, this week on this channel I'm showing random code snippets from Laravel Daily.com website from our own code base and today I will talk about API rate limiting based on example of quick Laravel tips. So maybe some of you don't know but on Laravel Daily website on top we have quick tips with a lot of tips around 500 and those are divided into topics and sections but what majority of you really don't know is we have public API for getting a random tip. So if you go to API v1 tips, you would get something like this, a JSON with random tip. If we refresh, there will be another random tip. We thought to use it ourselves to show the tips on other websites or Twitter or something like that. But in the end, we abandoned that idea, but the API still stayed working. But how could we protect that from being abused from spam and stuff like that, although it is public. As you can see, I'm not logged in or anything. It's not in Postman with Sanctum or anything like that. So the URL is like this. In Routes API, we have just tips with controller random method. It doesn't that matter that much what is in controller. What matters is this throttle random tips. Laravel has a function of throttling API requests or in fact any requests and you can define your own rules for that. So in route service provider there's configure rate limiting function and you may define the default rules for API. So per minute we have 60 attempts but specifically for random tips. So we came up with our own name of that throttle rules. We have it customized. So if it's local, then there's no limit. But if it's from outside, we limit 10 attempts. So 10 API requests per minute. And those are identified uniquely by user ID if they are logged in or if they are not logged in, then 10 requests per minute by IP address. So this is kind of a two in one tip for you. Maybe some of you didn't know about rate limiter at all that it can be customized for APIs. And also some of you wouldn't know that you can create your own rate limiter like this with custom rules and then assign it to the route by providing the throttle random tips here as a middleware. There is also a separate section in Laravel documentation about rate limiting with caching. So I will link that as well in the description below. That's it for this time and see you guys in other videos.